Looking to take your Madden game to the next level while dominating kids in Weekend League and learn high-level schemes from some of the best Madden pros in the world? Make sure you check out Hot Route Tips and use code CHAOS for 10% off at checkout. What's good everybody? Chaos here and y'all know what time it is. For those of you who aren't familiar, a Chaos Coaching video is where I take you guys inside my thoughts. I let you guys see the reasoning behind why I do why I do. Why I called a certain defensive coverage. Why I blitzed. Why I didn't blitz. Maybe why I did a certain adjustment on a certain player. All those things I break down for you guys today in this Chaos Coaching video. For those of you who are familiar, you guys know every time I do a Chaos Coaching video, I wear my Chaos Coaching hat. However, today's going to be a little bit different. I actually won't be wearing the hat. That job's going to be carried out by none other than Mini Chaos. I shall call him Mini Me. Yes, guys, that's right. I have my very own coach in the game. I am so blessed to have him. I hope you guys are rocking with him, too. With all that being said, guys, I am feeling a little bit sick today. My throat's been bothering me. I have had a cold for about a week. But if we get 300 likes on this video, it will make me feel a whole lot better. And I will continue to bring you guys Chaos Coaching videos like this that can help you guys get better at the game. Before we get into the gameplay, I do want to give you guys a little bit of Chaos Coaching on my team. So I have Andrew Luck. He's the best passing stats quarterback that you can get with Escape Artist. So you kind of get the best of both worlds. You get a very fast quarterback with someone who's going to make all the throws. I also have Dashing Deadeye on him so that he can make throws on the run. Uh, I have three good receivers now. I do want to replace Marvin Harrison. I want to move Torrey Holt to Marvin Harrison's slot and then get a, a second uh, wide receiver then get 90 deep route running. I have Deshaun Jackson right now. I eventually will be upgrading uh, to Donald Driver, I believe. So that's why I have my receiving core at right now. The O-line, solid, very solid. I have Bruce Matthews and Jordan Gross, both of which have edge protector and all day. They're both going to do a great job fighting against those other great elite pass rushers. And I put Bruce Matthews at backup, and that way his abilities are activated while he's at right tackle. George Kittle's my tight end. I don't throw to my tight end. I use three wide receivers, two running backs. Don't need a tight end, so there's no reason to upgrade him. We have the best Ryan Shazier. We're still waiting to get that Patrick Willis. Guys, if there's one flaw on my team, it's the fact I do not have an enforcer yet. I'm working towards Tillman. I'm working towards Patrick Willis. Get your guys' selves an enforcer. It'll help you guys tremendously on stopping the run. But we have Lawrence Taylor on the outside, Von Miller on the outside, Reggie White who plays DT. We do have Strahan and Limbaugh Joseph for when we have to go to 3-4 odd or 3-4 bear to stop the run. Then we have just solid corners all around. We do have Willie Brown activated with man up and zone out, but that is just simply because I don't have any enforcers yet. Once I get enforcers, he won't be activated. But here's the team, guys. Very, very solid. Let's ball. All right, we are into this one, man. Again, I apologize for my raspy voice. I am a little bit sick. If it's annoying to you guys, I'm sorry. There's not much I can do about it. I'm trying to grind these out for you guys despite being sick for about two weeks now. But we're going to grind this one out, and I'm excited for it. We're starting on offense. Again, my adjustments are going to mostly be talked about on defense. This is more of a defensive-minded video. I have offense coming next week, and I'm going to do another chaos coaching where I go in-depth on my offensive stuff. But we'll, we'll start on defense this week, and we'll carry on to offense next week. So this is a defensive video, if I do see something that I think that you guys should know, I will talk about it because I do think it's important that you guys see what I see on both sides of the ball. Right here is a 3-4 odd show blitz to first down. I'm just going to see how his run defense is out of it. I don't want to have to deal with this blitz on first down. See if he can stop the run from it and then go from there. The run defense didn't seem bad. I'm going to go to the pass here, see if he can actually scream out of this thing. It looked like he actually did scream, but... I, uh, this guy tripped. We'll take our dot. <laughs> this guy tripped coming in. I'll take it. He's going to 146. As soon as I see 146, I'm going to audible down. There's no way I'm going to try to pass against this thing if I can just tote on it. Hopefully, we can pick up good yards here. We'll see. Oh, yeah. Oh, hold your block. Ah, bad animation. We'll take it, though. Good catch, boy. Come on. We'll take that. That's cool with me, baby. We got Andrew Vick on our squad. Laser. Laser. Oh, my gosh. That was wide open. He's the best passing stats quarterback that you can get with escape artists. Just going to run the ball here. Try to make sure I pick up this first down.
Get out, boy. Get out, boy. Get out, boy. Let's go. Again, guys, if you guys are ever interested in my schemes, make sure you check out my description, hotroute.tips. You can get all my schemes as well as other pros on there. All right, this is the side of the ball you guys have been waiting for. I'm going to show you guys my adjustments and why I do what I do. Now, I'm setting up run defense here. It's first down and 10. I would expect him to come out running. He didn't. That's fine. We did send some pressure there just to make sure we could stop the run because it was an early down. I thought he might do that. Not worried about the run as much here. I'm going to set up some coverage defense. Try to take away any of his uh, any of his early reads. That's fine. I'll give up a few. Okay, not really worried about the run here. Setting up pass defense. Oh, come on, Ken. Oh, dude, I didn't realize he has Lamar Jackson. When someone has Lamar Jackson, you have to make sure you're worried about him every single play. I'm gonna start. Uh, I'm gonna start spying Ken Houston a lot. Oh, good run, dude. Uh, all right, I worry about the run more now. What I was saying though is I'm going to be spying uh, Ken Houston a lot more. No, I don't have to worry about Lamar Jackson myself, so I'll make sure to take it away with with my spies. Let's go, man. Huge play there. I'd like to hold him to three here. Make sure I get my uh, Ken Houston spy in. Oh, I didn't get it. I didn't get it. Okay, that's fine. Whew. I got to get that spy every single play. You don't want Lamar Jackson running over you. If people have Lamar Jackson, they have Michael Vick, they have Steve Young, or even Andrew Luck with, with uh, Skate Artists, you got to make sure you're putting the spy out there. Make the adjustment you need to do to lock people up. Middle of the field is mine. That's fine. Just make a tackle. Just make a tackle. That's fine. We'll take it. We'll take it. Good defense. This guy's a madman. Again, getting my spy in, making sure that I don't, I don't give up anything to Lamar Jackson. We're here. Let's go, man. That's good D. Come on. Kick your three. Again, going to start this drive off with a, with a run. Just making sure I test his run defense consistently. Making sure that he has it and he prepares for it. Keeping him honest. Oh, wow. Good D. We have to get out of our territory here. I need to pick up a decent chunk of yards. But I got to make sure I don't take a sack. I don't want to like get in safety territory or anything. But we like to pick up a big chunk here. That's fine. We'll take that. Get on the first down. First? Oh, come on. We'll go to dive here. I don't mind just punching this thing forward for a few yards. Get out. Get out, Clinton. Get out, Clinton. That's what I need, baby. Come on. This offense is so high-powered. I can pass out of it, and I can run, man. I'm telling you guys, this offense is so high-powered. It's going to be on Hot Route Top Tips in just one week's time. Just an FYI for you guys, this guy should be calling timeout. He's letting the clock tick. Not a great decision here. He needs to save time for himself to make a drive. I'm, of course, happy killing this clock all the way to the end. Clock's not an issue for me. Let's go, man. Perfect start to the game. I won't be setting too much pressure here. I don't want to mess around and give up a, good, a big play. So I'm just going to focus on making sure that I don't give up anything crazy and just play good coverage defense. Again, I'm going to make sure I'm spying Lamar Jackson every single play. I don't want him to pick up a big chunk with the skate artist. Oh, no. I'm stuck. I'm stuck on Reggie White. Get out there. Make the play. Make the play. Oh, ho, ho, ho. got my spy in. I'm feeling good here. I'm feeling like this is good defense. I have my spy. I have my good adjustments. I should be fine. It's a good D on the wheel. We have our spy there. You can't run. You can't run. Throw it to me. Throw it to me. Come on, man. Let's go. Get up. Get up. Come on. If you make the right adjustments, people will make mistakes. I put the spy out there. He couldn't outrun him. He throws me the ball. It's what happens. Even mini chaos is fired up. Look at him go, man. Let's get it. I'd like three before half here. Come on. Oh my goodness, I just got hollered at. Yo, all right. I need about eight yards here. I'm gonna max protect, make sure I don't scream that. Give, me, give myself time to make a read. Oh, I had it. Oh, wow. Awful timeout by him. Very, very bad. All that timeout did was give me time to get myself more points because if, I, if he stops me, he's going to have like three seconds. That's not enough time for him. All it did was give me a chance to go for it. I can't go for it if he doesn't call timeout. Oh, I dropped it. See, if I catch that right there, I probably have time to spike. I get three points. We go into half up three possessions. Now, instead, the alternative, he doesn't get any points. It doesn't make any difference. That timeout by him was not the greatest call. I would not recommend doing that personally. But 
to each their own. I didn't like his time out there. All it did was give me a chance at points without really giving him a chance. All right, this is essentially the drive of the game for him. He needs seven. If he doesn't get seven, he's likely going to lose, and he knows that. So he, need, he knows he needs to put, toge put, put together a drive right here, and I'm going to be ready for it. I'll give him the flats. Oh, maybe I won't. <laughs> But again, he's going to be bringing out all his toolboxes here. He's going to be running the ball. He's going to be taking his flats, making good reads. He doesn't need to rush anything. He, all he needs to do is just make sure that he gets a touchdown. So he's not going to be doing anything too crazy yet. He's not going to be taking too many risks. However, that doesn't mean I can't put some pressure on him, sending a lot of people at him. In a drive where I know he needs to get seven and he knows he needs to get seven, it doesn't hurt just to put some extra pressure on him. Oh, make that tackle. I'm cool with that. As long as I make the play, I'm cool with that. Ah, good play. Oh, wow. I didn't even see the... Good hit, man. Let's go. Big hit. Big hit. What's he going to do? What's he going to do? I'm on that. I'm on that. It's good D. It's good D. Pick that. Oh, my gosh. If that's anywhere accurate, that's a pick. Anywhere accurate. This is the game right here. I'm sending heat. I'm playing hard flats. Sending heat, playing hard flats. Oh, no. Good play. I see. I see. I didn't get over that. I saw it late. Good play by him. Good, good defense. Scream. Let's go, man. Good hit. Tony, you, you keep mixing up that pressure and that coverage. Things will work out for you. You'll get confused. And they'll, they'll make bad plays. I'm there. That's fine. That's fine, man. I'll give up one yard. Got my spy. I'm not giving up anything. I'm not giving up anything to Lamar. He's going to have to pass the ball. Let's go. Scream. 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 Come on, if you want blitzes like that, hot route dot tips. We're screaming out here. Anytime you get your opponent in a down like this, you're sending pressure. He gets seven right here. He gets the whole team. I'm sending everyone. I'm just gonna play deep zones. Man up that right side. I don't have to worry about anything except for just the, the receivers crossing the field. On that, I'm on that. He got all the pressure. He doesn't have anything. Let's go, man. Come on. He had stuff open, but he didn't have time. And that's going to do it, man. He gives up. Great dub for us. Guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys enjoyed the gameplay. I hope I was able to give you guys good advice. hope you guys were able to take some of that advice and take it into your own games. Again, I have to apologize. My voice is super raspy. I'm fighting through though, man. I'm giving you guys good content. At least I think so. But that's it for me. Like, comment, subscribe. Take it easy. Peace.